Right, hello and welcome. So, quick video here, bit of a short one because we are just going to be going over the three brand new cars coming to Gran Turismo 7 with this month's updates. And if my guesses are right, it's going to be a very good update because if I just play this clip for you, I want to know what cars do you think are in this trailer. <laughs> So, my first guess has to be the Audi R8, but to be more specific, I am looking at the Audi R8 V10 GT Rear Wheel Drive Edition, like the final, the last, the 2023 model. That is what I am expecting, that or it's going to be the R8 performance from 2020. Audi R8, a long requested vehicle that a lot of people wanted to a game. And even with last month's updates, I said I would have preferred if they added this car over the Audi TT. Well, looks like they did. So, moving on to another vehicle that I was really wanting to come to a game, and that is the Lamborghini Urus. Yes, it seems that we are finally getting performance SUVs to the game, which has been long needed. Yeah, it's been well overdue. And it is finally making its appearance in the game. And I am super excited about that. And lastly, I think the one that has been most requested from the time the game launched. The Toyota GT1 TSO20. Yes, that vehicle, that iconic Le Mans racer is making its appearance in Grand Turismo 7. It is about time and all I'm gonna say is be prepared to spend well over a few million to get your hands on that Toyota. So these are the three brand new cars that are coming to Grand Turismo 7 with this month's updates. So let me know in the comment section your thoughts on it. Do you think it's any other vehicles? But with this being said, thank you so much for watching and don't forget once the update does go live, I am going to be making reviews on all of these vehicles as well as all of the brand new engine swaps. So, with all this being said, thank you so much for watching, thank you so much for your time, and I will see you guys in the next Grand Turismo 7 video. Peace!